All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to another episode of At Dead of Night. I think we are uh, getting pretty close to wrapping up uh, Harvey's storyline here. I believe so, anyway. As always, I've got my little notepad here. That kicked off pretty intense right off the bat. Okay. You noted a fire in the basement. It was in the, uh, the old boiler room here. Is it Harvey? Yes. I saw a fire in the basement. What happened to the hotel? We managed to contain it before it got out of hand. Oh, photos and letters and everything were down there. It all went up in flames. Jimmy was out of control. I'd had enough of him. I wanted him gone. Okay. So we're going to do the fire. We've already done the dagger, the bats, we've done pretty, the only thing I don't think we've done yet is the gun, right? Who does the gun belong to? It was mine. It belonged to my father. Still had a few rounds of it. When you said you wanted Jimmy gone, does that have something to do with what you said about the gun? I'd lost him. I was seeing red. I hated him. I'd lost control. Oh, floor two. Alright, we lost him. Up to floor two we go. He's already... with a gun. <clears throat> okay. I've already got a mirror. I've already got a compass. Alright, so we've already got everything in here. So we probably just need to question in here. Is anyone there? Is it Harvey? Yeah, it's Harvey. Harvey was all bloody too. I don't know if you guys noticed that. I saw you with a gun, practicing with it. What were you going to do? I don't know what I was going to do. Threaten him, get him out of the hotel. Problem was, I didn't realize he was going to be on too. Oh. So he was armed. 
Everything here should be... Well, we already used... That's it's the only thing that's left is the dagger, right? Who does the dagger belong to? Everything else has been used. It's not a dagger. It's a letter open. It's not supposed to be sharp. It's not supposed to be. So did he sharpen it? When you said you didn't realize Jim would be armed too, does that have anything to do with what you said about the dagger? It wasn't even a dagger. I never learned my lesson. Jimmy was always one step ahead of me. him. Ground floor. Ground floor. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Ground floor it is. Jimmy's moving quickly. Oh my gosh. He would come right to my room. I heard him walk away. Last few times we've done this, he's faked it. And he's been hiding in the bathroom. So... That makes me really nervous. Okay, so he's definitely outside. Ah, I went the wrong way. It's always such a waste of... Okay, ground floor. Okay. I'm glad he doesn't like come crawling up to the elevator or anything like super crazy. Mind. You noted Harvey heading towards the ball the ballroom. I don't think we've been in the ballroom yet. Oh, look. That room on the left is lit up now. It was never lit up before. Oh, I hear it over here. Hello? Jimmy just backstab him in the freaking neck? Oh no. Then it plays that sad music, which means that's. That was it for Harvey. Is it Harvey? Oh no. Yeah, it's Harvey. 
I saw you being stabbed backstage. What happened? We've completed Harvey's story. So, we've done all three floors. Is there any other ghosts then? That's what I'm trying to like figure out is, is like, there's gotta be. something going on here. We got lights flickering here. Jimmy can be heard somewhere. Jimmy's coming. Oh no. Oh. We've got a, a, a girl now, I wonder if this is Rose. Floor two. Room three, we're in 301. Oops, I didn't meant to go out of the room, but this is this is different. Noted a man shouting and a child crying. Okay. He's wanting us to go to floor two. Looks like we've got a new ghost to talk to. Like I said, I wonder if it's Rose. Floor two. Jimmy's been hovering too, which worries me. That worries me a lot. <sighs> that sucks. He knows I'm in here. I'm gonna get hit. I'm calling it now. He's waiting. 100% he's around this corner waiting. I'm coming now. 
turn. Go in. Oh no. I knew it. put us down the first floor, which I guess is fine anyway. I need to go back this way. We gotta go this way. Okay, we gotta go get this device really quick. A little uh, spirit box thing. Okay, got it. All right, so we got we got to go to floor two. It's where the uh, that little scrying mirror thing was telling us to go. Explaining the dagger. Is someone there? Is someone there? Who is this? What's your name? Is it Rose? Rose. Rose Hall. It is Rose. No way. I saw a lady explaining that the dagger was a letter opener. Who was she? Wow, okay. So now we have Rose Hall. So this probably is the last ghost then, right? I think this is everybody that we've encountered in this hotel. Ground floor. So it's wanting us to go back to the ground floor then. Okay. Well, I guess what we'll do is we'll uh, save our game on that note and then wrap up another episode of At Dead of Night. Uh, possibly only maybe a couple videos left of this series and maybe we're done. Not too sure. 
The story is saying we are at, what does that say, 70%? It's behind my webcam there. So we're, I think we're getting pretty close to it. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it nonetheless. Thank you guys for watching. And we'll catch you guys next time.